It's time to scare up some creative ways to celebrate Halloween. Here to give us some ideas this morning on Studio 3, crafting expert Lynn Lilly, the founder of Craft Box Girls. Lynn, it is good to have you back on the show, uh, and happy Halloween to you. Let's talk about how we can really get the entire family involved in some Halloween fun. I see some really neat ideas that you have there. Yes, thanks for having me and happy Halloween. And you are right, we like to get the whole family involved. Whether that's decorating pumpkins together or creating crafty costumes or choosing the perfect spectacular treat. I like to have my kids get in on making some fun decorations. We pull out all the craft supplies and get the creativity flowing. All right, Lynn, where do you suggest we start? What's a, what's a fun place to begin with the family? Yes, well, we love to have the whole family involved, and that includes our pets. I love to get them in on the fun, and PetSmart has everything that you need to celebrate the Halloween season with your pets, including costumes under $20. So from classic to spooky costumes, they have all the Halloween essentials, like this fan favorite pumpkin costume from the Thrills and Chills brand, available exclusively at PetSmart. There's also a hot dog and a mermaid costume designed to fit both cats and dogs. They even have costumes for pets like lizards and guinea pigs, like this dragon and scorpion costume. Plus, PetSmart has you covered with treats for those four-legged trick-or-treaters. <laughs> those, those are all so, so cute. Uh, what are some other yeah. Halloween essentials that are on your list this time of year? Well, with Halloween right around the corner, it's important to help our kids protect their smiles from all of that sugary candy. So my tip starts with Tom's of Mean Silly Strawberry Toothpaste, and now it has a brand new look. This toothpaste helps our kids maintain their oral hygiene with natural fruit flavors that they will love to brush with again and again. This fluoride toothpaste for kids uses naturally sourced calcium and silica to gently clean their teeth. It has no artificial dyes, flavors, sweeteners, or preservatives conservatives and it's also ADA approved. You can check it out on Amazon or at tomsofmean.com to grab it today. And I will tell you since my girls have started using it, there's no more fights to brush our teeth. They absolutely love it. <laughs> it makes taking care of that uh, that morning and nightly chore a little bit easier for everyone. Uh, do you yes. have any other crafty <laughs> suggestions maybe for the family this Halloween? I do. I love to host parties and every year I host a Halloween egg hunt. That's right, egg hunt. We turn our backyard into a zombie graveyard. I hide Halloween themed eggs filled with treats and candy all over our yard and we invite over all of our friends and family. The kids hunt for eggs in the backyard. Everyone dresses up and it is such a fun Halloween tradition. I love that idea. Okay, um, what about any special <laughs> Halloween treats that you make with the family? Okay, so it's fun to make treats. We always go the no-bake route, so doing things that we can do with melted chocolate, maybe even turning cookies into spiders or ghost hats is always fun, but crafting is the big thing with our family because I am the queen of crafts, so we like to decorate pumpkins. My girls are young, so we don't do the carving pumpkins. We pull out the craft supplies and those plastic pumpkins you can get at the craft store. Let your kids paint them, add glitter, pom-poms. The adults can even get in on the fun, too. I love those. Those are super cute. Lynn, you, you've given us so many wonderful things that we could be doing this time of year with the family. Where could our viewers go to uh, find all of this? Maybe some more crafting ideas from you. Yep, they can head to tipsontv.com for all the fun that I shared today. All right, Lynn, always good to talk with you. Thank you so much for being back on Studio 3. And again, happy Halloween to you and your family. Happy Halloween to you too. Thanks for having me. Sounds good. We'll see you soon. I like her take on the pumpkins because I think everybody yes. traditionally thinks pumpkin carving route, not mm -hmm. necessarily painting them. Yeah, we've actually painted them most years. Really? Okay. Yeah, but it, it was just easier for me. I think it's really hard to get in there and start carving a pumpkin. Yeah, I'm no carving know? expert. <laughs> <laughs> but then they last longer too. You That's know, true. once you, if you get pumpkins early, if you carve them, depending on the weather, and like last week we saw 80 degree weather, mm -hmm. they start getting mushy and kind of, you know, Kerplunk in. Which so. is something that we talked with. Um, we had Rick Griffith on here last yes. week because they're getting ready to pumpkin get ready for the pumpkin house. Yep, in Canova. And that's what he said. He said, we'll start carving, you know, 
days before. He said because if you do it too early, yeah. then they're rotting, they're falling in on each other, and, and it's you want to try to preserve cool them. Again this week, but we don't know what's going to be like right. that week leading yeah. up to Halloween. The weather keeps mm -hmm. changing, but the 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 painting of the pumpkins is just fun. I loved the little dono one too that yes. had all the sprinkles on the top. Was yeah. that not adorable? And honestly, like I painted a pumpkin a couple years ago with my little girl, and I had just as much fun. So I well, and I've seen some of the cutest ones on social media. Yeah. I saw one um, mom, she did like the the characters from the Minion movies. Uh -huh. Like she did Gru and put the oh, nose yeah. on it and, and then he painted the little do. Minion ones. I was like, that's so cute. Yeah. I love ideas like that. I do too. And um, I just, it makes it fun for everyone and you get to spend a little quality time yes. together. And it's, I mean, it's messy on a same different scale than right. carving. Right. Yeah. But yeah. Fun yeah. for everyone. It is. It sure is. Well, coming up on Studio 3,